The fine is 30,000 or 25,000, depending. Giddy bouncing. Eric gripped the towel, man. No idea how, but I did. The gorgeous dress I bought from Zara in Italy. Oh no, wait. That time I came back from Italy, just ripped. It just ripped. Anyway, we're on our way to Obby's. We're going to pack the rest of our stuff. Bring it back here. Because we're leaving Asaba tomorrow. I'm not carrying you along, but I just wanted to say hi. Good morning. They say good morning. Good morning, guys. I know. I know that's what he's going to say. Good morning, guys. Good morning, guys. Catch you guys in a bit. So let's show you guys market life. That's even if I can, if I can manage them, because. The way cars are ready to run you over. <laughs> You're not paying in mind. In Nigeria, they're not charge you to get money because there's no money. It's, it's crazy in Nigeria. To get money is a problem. That's how much? 1,000. 2,000. Is that old money or new money? They estimate it to the new city. How much is the charge to get 10,000 now? 2,000. 2,000 on top. Dad's helping us to grind it now. Grinding, grinding. <laughs> Tired. Tired. When you walk tomorrow, you come straight. Body and Mama, don't need bad energy. Are they tired? The heat is much. Walking in the heat to market. It's not my thing, bro. Put on the right, put on the right, but you see what I'm doing. Because of the pepper, it's a great girl. I never put that to do to do. I'm going to go there. 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 I'm going you remember one now? Yeah. Let me check the Which pink one. Color? Let me check the pink one. Yeah, but... Pure water, pure water. This is our seasoning. The bag is heavy. I'm holding it for my husband. Whilst he gets his grand nuts. The guy grinded for us for like an hour, you know? Yeah. It was an hour. But we finally finished. We're now leaving, I think. I live in the market. I'm thirsty, <coughs> hungry, but we got what we needed done. These kids selling pure water on the road. They will sell all because today is hot. No, 
why Sis likes walking in the road. She's literally walking in the middle of the road. <laughs> Parked in the car park, which is 200 naira on the road. There's lots of parking on the side street, but Sis said you'll get fined, so mm -hmm. might as well come and park here. How much is the fine? Side street. 200? Yeah, to park. Ah. No, the fine if you park on the side of the road. Okay, 30,000 or 25,000, depends on what you're doing. Wow. Did you hear? The fine is, the fine is 30,000 or 25,000, depending if you park on the side of the road. So I might as well just pay 200 and come and park here. Everyone's tired. Waiting Everyone's hungry. Everyone's thirsty. Yeah. But we shall. Yes, you. <laughs> We should have got what we needed to do done. Abi, you didn't get ut Utazi. There's certain things we didn't get, but what happened with what we did get? Oh, my seatbelt. This is the side of the roads that you can park. As you can see. But there's traffic warden. Is that traffic warden? Yeah, so that's who's giving out the fines, but you can just see pop on the side. There's so many shops on each side. They got us water. back in shop right so that bacon barbie's here we're going to the black and white salon and um, i like the space there the one in onitra is bigger but this one's still cool so i'm going to show you original mm -hmm. original bad man oh. i like it Temper. <laughs> this thing is moving it I like how you giving me steadily. You like that? <laughs> <laughs> Faithful. <laughs> Faithful. My head to swell, I'm making man feel sweat to hear Baby, love me gently Baby. Do you like it? Yeah Ooh, that's nice <laughs> To Bob, Eric's hair, it cost him 2000 I don't know if I told you how much it cost me to do my braids Mine was 6000 Very cheap hair I would say my braids cost 6000 But my sis paid for me So shout out to Juliet Not sure how much the girl who braided is actually gonna get out of that six thousand, but I did, I did give her a tip because I, I don't really know how it works there. Like obviously the boss is gonna get the most, mm -hmm. but there's so many workers. If they're offer, offering their services so cheaply, how much are they actually gonna make? There's economy, yeah. <coughs> nobody, nobody have so they have to put in the price people can't afford, which makes sense. So being that in UK I spend a lot on my braids, I can actually give more. So like, if you're in the position to, it's always good to give more, to be fair. Um, especially when you know how much you usually pay. But yeah, like they said, they price according to how much people can actually afford here. And it's not a lot. To be attacked by who? By all those bad people, they attack police in their station so in the night. Is there a police station there? Yeah, there's a police. Okay. So, yeah. Okay. So the road will usually go down to get home. They blocked it because there's a police police headquarters there, and people come and attack the police at night. So if cars are queued up, there'll be easy for civilians to also be attacked. 
Is this a police headquarters? Thing from that face. Yeah, it's a criminal thing. It's easy for someone to shoot at police. Are those police standing there? Yeah, they are police. Due to the insecurity. It's not that people usually come and attack. Recently, there have been an attack on police. We're in the shop. Sis has made some clothes for me. I've got two dresses so far. And you'll see them when I wear them in, during summer. As long as London actually gives us a summer this time around. Probably wear them to church. <coughs> this one has been in the shop too long. What's he doing, please? <laughs> With a hammer. What are you doing? That's the dance for the cheers of my town. That's the chiefs. It's been a long day. It's getting a shawarma. We're back in the hotel. I'm about to try my shawarma. It's called the root It's called what? Double. Uh, which meat is in this? Caramel goddess. Mm. Just showered. It's actually um week fourteen of my Invisalign journey. 14 of 31. I like to do it at night so that as I'm sleeping, my mouth adjusts to the tightness. Ah. Mm, tight. Tight. Especially the bottom. Wow. Oh, wow. Anyway, I've just finished showering as you can see my enemies are after me with these spots so I keep using these dot for spot stuff they're trying to make me ugly but I'll never be ugly in Jesus name as you saw earlier we went to the market fun facts the market we went to the owner of this hotel also owns that market he also owns this water company and you'll find this water in the hotel so that's that's a fun fact that sis told me she told me when we were in the market what's it called again obongolongo obongolongo market when we went to the market first of all we we're trying to price down because everything was expensive and then when we finally did price down it was like the person doesn't accept bank transfer they don't accept card they wanted cash by force so we had to go and find cash now imagine bay and sis got 10k in cash in order to get that 10k they had to pay 2k so altogether they paid 12k this is how nigeria is commonly trying to function this is what they think functioning is they've stopped the use of old cash apart from 200 naira notes now but they're not circulating the new cash so people are stuck they say okay cool even though we're not accepting old cash you can get new cash but you have to pay for it imagine now paying to get cash that sits in your bank account even the atms in london that often require me to pay like one pound 79 charge or whatever i walk away from those so i can't even imagine 
just trying to get new cash and being told I need to pay XYZ. After the market, we were in Sissy's shop. She made me four, is it four pieces of clothing? One I'll wear tomorrow, so you'll see that one tomorrow. And yeah, we just stayed there while she was doing that. We got some clothes altered as well that we brought from London. Eric got some chinos altered, his shorts, just some stuff that I, I bought for him because er Eric likes a particular fit. That's a particular style. That style was skinny, slim. <laughs> and the chinos were given straight leg, right? So he got those altered. I got a few items altered as well. All of our suitcases are now in the hotel. So tonight what we've been doing is packing and essentially we're all packed um we just need to put padlocks on the suitcases and the only things left to pack are like um toiletries that's it really toiletries like the things that we're using tomorrow morning after our shower and stuff so yeah it's definitely going to be an early night for me i am tired eric is exhausted eric tapped out ages ago the boy butt naked, but say night. No. Does it even have the energy? Um, I'm probably gonna put the AC on, but I need Eric to pull this duvet. They pulled, they put the duvet into the bed so securely that I don't, I don't, I can't pull. I don't know if he has the strength to pull. Babe, can you pull this duvet? So he has a strength to pull, so I'll put the AC on again tonight. I think we slept with it yesterday throughout. I'm fighting the bed. Like a tap thing there, mate. It's still not up, it's still not pulled out enough for me. Once the AC's on, this goes right up to my neck. So thank you, babe. It's officially our last night in Asaba. We we're supposed to go out tonight, but again, all of us are tired. Can't even lie, all of us are tired. And sis finished the clothes late, and I wasn't even in the mood. I just wanted to come home, shower, and go to bed. It's been a good one. I've actually enjoyed myself. I prefer Asaba to Onitra because Onitra is still quite village-like. Whereas Asaba has a nightlife. It has more in terms of shops. It has more in terms of services, you know. So it's definitely a place I could dig if I were to stay in Delta State. God, fix my skin, please. I'm over it. I'm literally over it. Um. Anyway, I digress. Sis is more like me. Yeah, we're kind of we're kind of similar in the way we think, you know, the things we like to do and stuff like that. So it's been good hanging out with her. I need to, babe, I need to message Juliet. Can you send me her number, please? I need to message Sis and Onicha because I haven't spoken to her. Um, we were supposed to see her mom today, but due to like insecurity and all and the death in the family it wasn't possible so didn't officially get to say bye to mum dad and sis but by god's grace all of us will be healthy and well for our next trip so that's fine and until then we've got facetime <laughs> so yeah Hopefully there'll be no tears at the airport tomorrow when sis drops us off. I'm signing out now. I'm tired. I'm starting to ramble. And there's no need. I will see Brighton early tomorrow morning. We have to sleep actually early so that we can wake up early, have breakfast and be ready by 10 when sis gets here. So yeah, catch you guys tomorrow. got here and the check-in wasn't open we already knew that the flight was going to be delayed the shana said that the flight is 2:20. i'm slightly annoyed because i, I we could have slept in what next? Not a 
I didn't get a good night's sleep yesterday. One thing about this hotel, the bed is hard.